History now in the making Freedom is ours for the taking yeah. History now in the making All right, everybody, I'm back on the scene. Let's get into this fresh video update. So gather around, ladies and gents, boys and girls, crypto freaks, money making maniacs, degens, brethren and sisters, all of you thirsty financial freedom warriors. It is time to buckle up, saddle up, and we're going to get back on out into the crypto streets from Afghanistan all the way on down to Zimbabwe. All right. So we got another fresh mint stake share video, as I said, to bring to your attention. Let's get right on over to it. So this platform is continuing to do what it is designed to do, paying 2% daily on our deposits. That is, of course, if you're in the staking protocol, you are earning 2% daily on what you've got in there. So let's scroll through and check out some of the uh, latest milestones. I mean, this thing is never failing to impress. Still holding 14 cents. Uh, seven days later, after we took a very, very um, impressive jump from eight cents all the way up to 14 cents over just what, like a really one day period, less than that. And then we have maintained for seven days here this um, 14 cents. Okay, as I scroll down, you can see what the current stats are sitting at um, 4.7 million market cap. We've got a liquidity of $1.3 million and um, a total supply of three, or I'm sorry, 33.7 million MSS out there in circulation, right? And the base, how low can you go? Those stats over here um, are building up strong, right? It is, I think what, since last Thursday, effectively live uh, that you can mint and you can stake, all right? But trading has not yet uh, at the time of this recording on Sunday. Uh, it has not gone live yet. It may be going live uh, this coming Tuesday or Thursday. So of course, we'll keep you guys uh, in the know for that. But always, of course, plug into the telegrams, all right? And the socials, um, Mint Stake Share, they have a very, very active, very rapidly growing uh, Telegram. So be sure to get plugged in over there. Um, and by the way, of course, make sure you plug into the Experience Crypto 24 uh, seven Telegram and you would, you know, I'll keep you up to date and in the know as much as possible as well over there. Um, so anyhow, though, again, as we continue to check out the milestones that we have passed here, let me get over to the stake side and show where we have uh, now, and of course, it does show for both sides too. We have a total of 1579. All right, so 1579 uh, users, stakers in the protocol on the BNB side. And then for the base side, we've got already 183, all right, that have what is this about 52.6 thousand dollars uh, worth of. MSS on this side. So again, rocking and rolling with this 2% daily. Again, yeah, I've got a, a little bit in here of staking on the uh, base side with this, uh, yeah, 786 uh, MSS tokens. Just, you know, just threw something in there to see what, you know, see what it do. Uh, over here on the base side, I'm sorry, on the BNB side, Got to click onto BNB to make it switch over. As you can see, I have 10,000 MSS tokens ready to be staked, which is, you know, currently, what is that, about $1,400, a little over $1,400 worth of MSS tokens. Keep in mind that if you withdraw, you are going to be taking one half of that available, right? And of course, that one half in terms of the 5,000 tokens that I would withdraw would also come out of this staking position. All right. So that's how they maintain the stability. So people don't abuse the platform in a way that, well, of course, it's just not going to last if people just taken out of this thing and not continuing to put back in. But I am going to do a quick 
uh, stake compound in my stake position here on video for you, as we usually do. Um, so let me bring that up off camera here with my Rabi wallet. Of course, make sure all of you guys who had who haven't already heard about Rabi, right? Rabi.io. Do get yourself plugged in and get your um, you know your DeFi wallets uh, you know imported over to Rabi. Or of course, you can start a fresh new wallet if you'd like. But let me go ahead and compound this ten thousand. So this will bring me up to three hundred and twenty-six thousand um, total in my deposits. It should actually <laughs> three hundred and twenty-seven thousand. All right, which is uh, almost fifty thousand dollars worth deposited into the uh, staking protocol. So, and again, uh, yeah, if you guys want to start building your position over on the base side, you just simply click up here if you'd like. All right, switch on over to base, or again, you can do it from here like this, okay? And that will easily switch you over to your chains uh, as well, okay? So um, let me also show for people, um, I think something that is very helpful, all right? And then we're gonna wrap this video up because uh, got some things to do, we've got some uh, activities to get involved with here. Um, out in the real world, right? I got to get my feet on the ground, get my steps in for the day, get my miles in for the day. But I'm going to show you a easy way to bridge over tokens, right? Cross chain uh, from one chain to the other with different tokens using Interport. All right. So this is a platform that, you know, effectively just gets your tokens over from one chain over to base, for example, in this case. All right. Let me switch and show the actual um, way to bridge. So if I wanted to take from, let me click on this to show, you know, the available chains, Ethereum, Blast, Base, um, a lot of, you know, ones that you're familiar with, Avalanche, uh, Arbitrum. So in this case, if I wanted to switch from Avalanche, right, and take some tokens over from Avalanche, right, you can do that, right? And you select the token that you want, Ether, I mean, you can do um, uh, Tether, you know, you can do USDC coin and several different options, right? Because options from one chain to the next is very, very important. Um, but a lot of people are coming over from uh, BSC. So, of course, if you're on BSC, just do like that. Switch on over to BSC and then select the coin that you want, right? Uh, you can see the coins here that you could choose. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm not even sharing the tab. My apologies. My apologies. So again, let me show what I was talking about. So again, you can switch from different chains like this, all right? Avalanche, Ethereum, Blast, etc. cetera, all right? Arbitrum. And again, you can switch tokens. Uh, in this case, I'm over here on uh, BSC, and I could switch from... Um, BUSD token, wrapped BNB, USDC, DAI, Tether, etc. Okay, so uh, and then of course, make sure that you have the proper chain that you want to go to. In this case, base, right? If you want to take your um, BNB, switch it on over, <coughs> excuse me, you can switch it straight into the token as well. It doesn't have to be the same token. So again, if I want to do BNB, into e Ethereum, which is again the transaction token over on base, then you just simply put in you know what you've got to Ethereum. I mean to uh, BNB, for example, and it's going to calculate what that would be in um, in Ethereum, right? So BNB to Ethereum from BSC over to base, all right? And that's an easy way to get your Ethereum over there, so you can buy fresh from the base side of uh, mint stake share okay so i hope i haven't made that too confusing i apologize for the delay and switching over uh, but that is how you can purchase if you come over to the mint side here right and if you've got ethereum in here you just go ahead and purchase i think this is about twelve dollars worth nine dollars right so i got nine dollars worth of um ethereum in fact let me i guess i can do this on Zamp for example here and put in um, let's do this amount, which will give me 139 MSS. Okay. 
And keep in mind that the uh, transaction fees are very cheap over on the base side. So let me see. I may have to actually go a little bit lower. Or maybe I got to refresh. Let's see if we can do just a quick example here on video. Oh, no, I put in the wrong amount. That's what it was. All right. So just putting in this small amount right here. And this will, let's do 25. This will give me 43 MSS, right? Over on the uh, base side. So quickly, let's do that over here with Ravi. And this will add to the tokens that I have. And then, of course, if you wanted to, you could do an auto stake. But let me come over to the uh, stake side here. And that should show up. Yeah, as you can see right there, boom. And then I can go ahead and put that amount max. It's going to come up here. I have to approve it like you would do on BSC. And then you can put that amount in. It'll also compound what you've already accumulated. As you can see, it's just one uh, MSS. And this will switch, as you can see, and you just hit that. And that's another transaction, just tap it. So just a quick example for people to show how to mint and to stake over on the base side, all right? so. Like I said, I'm going to wrap it up. Uh, I think I've given you guys enough info for this particular video. And uh, yeah, stay tuned. All right. We are doing the damn thing with Mint Stake Share, continuing to grow. What will be the next uh, new high? I don't know. But I bet there's a, another new all time high coming in real, real soon. So, anyways, though, you guys stay up to speed, stay up to date. And we will, uh, yeah, we'll see you in the next video update. All right. Talk to you soon. Peace.